try that? Welcome to Kidsplosion! And man, do we have a crazy, exciting night for you. This week's Bible verse is... Give thanks to the Lord, for He is good. His faithful love endures forever. Psalms 136.1 These are our actions for the Bible verse. Give thanks to the Lord, for He is good. His faithful love endures forever. Let's do it one more time. Give thanks to the Lord, for He is good. His faithful love endures forever. This week we're learning all about God's unstoppable love. Even when Zacchaeus didn't make great decisions and he didn't have Jesus living in his heart, God still loved him so much. And even without God's love in his heart, Zacchaeus, he still loved other people in his life. So we're going to pretend that these cups are people. And I'm going to be the green one. Now, if I don't have Jesus in my heart, I still have love for other people. I still love my mom and my dad. So I take the love that's inside of me, and I can share that with the people around me. But what starts to happen is my love for others can soon start to run low. Because sometimes we can get really frustrated and when we don't have God's love in us, it's hard for us to love other people the way that God loves other people. And so soon, we love the people around us, but oh, we're starting to run out of love. And that can be a problem because it makes it really hard to get along with people if you don't have love for them the way that God loves us. But guess what? <sighs> this is God's love. And God has so much love for you and for me. And so when I'm feeling empty, when I ask Jesus in my heart, even when I don't feel like I have any more love to give, God's love can fill me up, and then I have more of God's love to share with others. And God never runs out of love for you or for me. He has an endless amount of love. And then when we're full, we can take that love and share the love that God gave us with the people around us. And we never run out of love. God loves you so much. And His love for you never runs out. And it never goes away, no matter how we act. God loves us, and He wants to live in your heart and help you to live for Him. Hey guys, it's my favorite time again. It's time to worship. Let's dance.
look at this week's main point. God never gives up on me. Now let's practice our actions from Sunday. God never gives up on me. Good job. Let's pray. Jesus, we love you. Thank you so much that you love us in the good times and even in the times that we don't feel great. God, thank you that no matter what, your love is unstoppable. I pray that we would always remember this in your name. Amen. Speaking about remembering things, don't forget to do the Bible verse challenge. Now that challenge is simple. You write it on a mirror, write it on a window, write it on a piece of paper and show somebody. Write it in your driveway. Write it on a trampoline. Any way you want. Write it so others can see it. Can't wait to see you guys on Sunday. Now I have God's love all over me. That's, that's not really what, go get dry clothes on. We'll see you next time, guys.